Hey there, hot stuff. I'm hot. You're hot. It is so damn hot right now. It's the middle of summer, and I feel like SpongeBob all dried up like in that one episode. You guys remember that episode? I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. Whoo! It's literally 100 degrees right now, and I am melting! Anyways guys, what's up? It's your girl for jokes. Welcome back to my channel I honestly didn't think I'd be back so quickly with another video I mean, it feels like just yesterday. I was at the nail salon blowing $90 on nails that only lasted you ready for this a week <laughs> You got that right after only a couple days all my nails started lifting and falling off But I mean you get what you pay for right? Wait a minute $90 is actually pretty expensive. I mean, I've gotten press-on nails at Walmart that have lasted longer than that. And those only cost like five bucks. <sighs> Anyways, turns out there's a lot of worst reviewed nail salons in my area, so what can possibly go wrong? I came across another worst rated place, so I'm gonna read y'all a few of the reviews. Okay, so this person said, if you love fungus, infections, chemical burns, Nails that look like as if someone with no fingers, on acid, with seizure-like spasms, going off every five minutes did them? Then, this is definitely the place to go. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, I'll take none of the above, thank you very much. <laughs> Woo, Chili, what did I just read? <laughs> Now, this review, it's a little outdated. It's from 2015, but I got more recent ones, and I'm talking from a couple days ago within the last few months. So this place has been getting pretty bad reviews for more than half a decade. Like, girl, get it together, boo. Okay, this next one, which was 12 days ago, says... I got cut twice and my toes are still in pain. Yikes, I feel your pain, boo-boo. I know what it feels like, I know. Another person said the owner seems to enjoy arguing with potential returning customers. Yikes. This last person said there's a 99, a 99% 99 chance your nails will get infected that's a pretty high percentage and a pretty high risk so let's go see what happens anyways this is the design that i want to get done hopefully they can do them let's go check it out hi appears to be just a little bit ghetto to me a little bit ghetto you know a little bit hood
I was shocked, honey. I was in tears almost. And it has a white refrigerator. I was like, oh, oh not a white refrigerator. Bruh. When in doubt, pinky out. All right, guys, let's talk about these nails really quick. These nail salons, they never cease to shock me. <laughs> Every experience is always so different. So these are my nails. Um, in the picture, it's like two different pinks. She told me she couldn't do two different pinks. So I, I said it was okay that she could just use the one pink polish color. Take a look at these flames though, guys. Ain't they hot? <laughs> Seriously, what the heck? They look like pitchforks. I think the only thing that came out halfway decent were these checkers right here, but this is how the nails came out, guys. The whole salon was a hot mess. Everything looked unorganized and filthy, but the lady that did my nails was very nice. Um, that's about it, though. <laughs> Other than that, there was a moment where she did go a little crazy with the drill. It felt like she cut me. I felt like a little sting, but after that, she noticed and she was pretty careful after that. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and join the Joker family. And also make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up. And I'll catch you on the next one.